I was first briefed on October the 31st that there were matters that the Chief Executive of the Ministry of Housing and Urban Development was looking into. Um, I was told at that point that um, it would be better if I wasn't briefed on any of the details uh, about that, and I took that advice and I am holding to that. Uh, and about three weeks ago, I was told that Mr Barclay was no longer at work. So given that you were basically offered plausible deniability, this sounds like a serious matter. Well, I, I can't comment on that. I have no information to base that on. All I can say is that, as has been reported, um, there is an employment dispute between Mr Barclay and the Ministry. So we the Prime Minister me. said yesterday that it's not to do with the policy, it's not to do with the programme, so it must then be a personality issue. I, I can't comment on that. I mean, I'm just all I can say is that it is an employment dispute. As the Prime Minister said yesterday, um, it has nothing to do with the policy or the implementation of the Kiwi Bill Programme. So has she got more information than you? No. So then can you, I mean, is it real, realistic then for you to say you can't make any comment about it when you clearly do have other information? Um, no, I've told you everything I know, that um, I was briefed on this first on October the 31st, um, that the, there were matters that the Chief Executive was looking into. Three weeks ago I was informed that Mr Barclay was no longer at work, um, and as has been reported, there is an employment dispute. But look, I don't. Um, I didn't hire Mr. Barclay. I don't manage the public servants. I'm simply advised by them, and and I think that um, you know some of the people who've been commenting publicly about this, they know full well that when there's a, an employment dispute in the public service, it's not the business of the minister to wade into that. You have you have previously commented on his employment before. So can you see why or how this looks like a double standard? No, look, I welcomed the employment of Mr Barclay as the Chief Executive of the Kiwi Build Unit. I think that was an entirely appropriate thing to do. But look, I want to make the point that... So now uh, what's going on with Hang on, I want, to make the, I want to make the point that um, Kiwi Build is a big program, right? It's about building houses, we're setting up an urban development authority, we're changing the planning rules, we're changing the way that infrastructure is financed, we're building public housing. Um, it's a big, big program, and there are a lot of people working on it. It's as much bigger than one person. But can you see that the public maybe, you know, lose confidence given that the head of this new unit within six months is there's a problem, and he hasn't been doing the job that he was hired to do for whatever reason? Well, um, you're making an, an assertion there that I'm not, um, I'm not validating that he hasn't been doing the job. But you've always well, got you've to kick things up to the top though, right? So this is a big programme, but yes, he was the boss of it. So this undermines the Kiwi Build programme. Um, it's certainly an unwelcome distraction. And I'm as focused as I can be on ensuring that as a government, we're implementing this policy and we're building houses. And we are, we're doing so many things uh, in this area. There's an entire new ministry uh, devoted to implementing this program. It's much, much bigger than just one person. So are you saying that he's been working from home? I, I can't comment on well, that. Well, you just said that my inference that he hadn't been doing the job was incorrect. So has he been working from home or is he on leave? I, I don't know that. He hasn't been at work um, for the last few weeks and I was informed of that three weeks ago. So, why, so did I you, have no why did you push back at the suggestion that he hadn't been doing the job? Because if he's on leave, then doesn't that follow? Uh, well, uh, it may, but I don't have any detail on which to, um, to base any comment on that. I'm, I'm not going to comment on what is an employment dispute.